Hello guys, Flying Dutchie here and welcome back to the last episode of this uh, Let's Learn run. I decided to uh, start a new run because I have learned so many things in the last two weeks. And the last time I was recording in this run was five days ago, I think. And I learned so, so much and I, I think I, get, I want to do a new run and uh, stream that on Twitch. So uh, this is going to be the last one. Uh, I want to thank everyone for uh, telling me uh, some tips and tricks. For example, the uh, Ireland title here. You can remove the succession law. Uh, we took the tennis free elective law, but you can just remove it. And uh, yeah, we should do that actually. So let's see, it's no cost and now it's gone. So we will have no elections anymore. And uh, we just inherit as you would normally do. But yeah, at the moment. Uh, our son and my other son will get a bit as well but yeah that's uh, the thing I learned and I guess the decision comes back now to do the, the tennis tree or no no it's not even here anymore so and yes I uh, I just want to do a new run a proper run with all the knowledge I have right now I, th I guess we can just finish this war real quick uh, what's this again oh yeah we are ransoming some people and yeah, I want to stream it on uh, on uh, Tuesday and Thursday on Twitch. I think those uh, two days are going to be my uh, streaming days. And uh, also this Tuesday, after I'm uploading this video, I will start my new run. So I hope to see some of you in, in the Twitch chat. It will be from uh, 7 till 11 European uh, time in the evening. Oh, look at this uh, the siege weapon, the graphics. He's throwing a rock at my fort. Boink. <laughs> I have never seen that. That's actually pretty funny. Let's just try to fight this uh, this battle here since we will stop the run. Uh, yeah, we will just uh, fight with a 30 advantage guy here. Oh, one of them uh, is not helping. That's interesting. Yeah, I'm scheme at court. But yeah, we united Ireland, we are king of Ireland, and that was uh, the main goal. And uh, we will come back, I promise you. We will try to form uh, Britannia at some point. But I think in my new run on Twitch, I'm gonna start in Norway. Do a uh, barbaric Norwegian Norse uh, let's play. Oh yeah, it's super easy to win. Well, easy. They also routed 1200 of my my troops, so not uh, not uh, very small. Yeah, this war was for this thing here, I think. Yeah, I mean, if if we would continue, we would just uh, gobble up Scotland, and then at some point we have to fight England. Try to form an alliance with uh, France. Oh, we already have that one. Maybe the Holy Roman Empire. I also learned about um, the feasts and the uh, the hunts you can call. Uh, you can get uh, some, some lifestyle traits. I don't know how they exactly work, but the more times you do a feast and a hunt, you the better traits you can get. So that's very interesting. Uh, the only thing I have uh, still a questions about for you guys is if I educate my children, what will determine their, their uh, education trade. I mean, at the moment, we are... Uh, she is uh, learning my child. And she has uh, three charismatic negotiator education trade. And she's intelligent and she has good learning. But what, what makes the difference? How was it in CK2? For the people uh, that know this. Uh, do we need to look at only the learning skill? The higher the learning skill, the better. Do you want someone with the same education trade you're trying to get yourself? For example, uh, over here. You are 18. She's 15. And she is going for a diplomacy education. So what do we need? Do we need to uh, let her be teach by someone that has a d diplomacy education trade? Or is the learning more important? I don't know. What I also learned is that when you um, assign a court physician, 
the quicker you do this, the more trades you can uh, can get with that person. So preferably you want to get a core physician as quickly as you can and someone that is pretty young with good learning. That's what you should do. Uh, I don't know who is my... Do I have a court physician right now? I don't think so. Now my son is having 16. And he is 18 years old. So if I do this, then he, he gets time to develop um, traits that has something to do with this position. So that's what, what you should do as well. And I think... That was all I wanted to talk about, so let's just finish this war off. Do we also have siege weapons? Oh yes we do. Boink. I think in the new run I'm gonna start in 867. I think that's the starting date. I'm gonna start somewhere in Norway. It's a small country. And then uh, I will try to form uh, the Kingdom of Norway. And then we will go for Scandinavia. And then we're gonna spread the Norse religion. The fun thing is that it's very war focused at the start and you need to reform to feudal if you want and you have to reform your uh, your religion. So it's going to be very interesting. Oh, he left my court. Oops. Chancellor. Sure, doesn't matter anymore. We're going to stop very soon. The links of all my uh, stuff is in the description of the video. You can also find the links in my banner on YouTube. I think my Twitch channel is also linked over there. So, uh, I'll see some of you uh, tomorrow. If you can't make it, I will upload the VODs to YouTube. You can still see everything on YouTube. Yeah, now we have to walk back again before they siege my capital. And that's something you really need to prevent. What did they, what did they just get? Did you saw that boost that the AI got here? Bullshit. What a bullshit. Now they captured me and now they win. And that's something what is happening all the time as well with uh, the AI. It happens so many times that the AI is getting so lucky and doing this thing. You don't need that one. Demand payment for hooks. Now that sounds interesting. Here, I demand a payment from you. <laughs> oh no, you're a child. <laughs> oh god. Do we have someone in our court? Yes, you. Demand payment. Oh yeah, we are imprisoned. So yeah, Scotland won the war. Because he impres imprisoned me because he uh, occupied my uh, my capital. Because the AI is cheating and gets a progress of 100 points in one uh, in one go. So it's really annoying. There are some really annoying things that can happen in this game. So yeah, bear with me in the new run in uh, Norway. I hope you guys uh, like this short uh, tutorial and let's learn. And I hope to see some of you in the next series. Preferably live on Twitch, and otherwise you will see the videos uh, appear on the YouTubes. So, thanks for watching guys, and I hope to see you guys in the next video. Bye bye.